Hello, darlings. You've all heard of Marilyn Monroe. Some of you know Bridget Fardo. Well, now it's time for the cognac show. I said cognac, ooh, ooh. I said cognac, ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm a bubbly blonde, fabulously dressed to impress. One of a kind girl I was brought into this world Wrapped up in pearls I love to mingle Though my husband reminds me I'm not single I meet and greet both the famous and the elite I ride in limousines drinking the finest champagne Wearing first dazzling diamond jewelry A girl can't complain I live in upscale life Dining in the finest restaurants, eating the best caviar for free. And no matter how much I enjoy myself, they can't charge me. Well, Elaine, and we are here on the red carpet at the Ferrari Rally, right here in East Hampton at Georgica Restaurant. Keep watching. More into <laughs> Well, Elaine, and we are here at George right here for the Ferrari Rally in East Hampton, and I'm here with Real Housewife. Dina Manzo from the Real Housewives of New Jersey. Now tell me, darling, what brings you to this event? Um, beautiful weather and Ferraris. What better reason? And the food is delicious, too. I just had a little shrimp. Is this <laughs> like your favorite restaurant in the Hamptons? One of them, yes. I do adore um, the appetizers here, so yes, do very you much so. enjoy riding in Ferraris? Um, we had one for a while. I, I love looking at them more than driving one. I think it's really more of a man's car. I hate I to be know, like, I know, I agree with you. and all that. I like a fast car, but I don't want to hear it. You don't want to hear it. Well, my husband, by the way, who is my filmmaker today, uh -huh. his father owned two Ferraris. Okay, so you so, know the noise. Yes, I know the mm. noise. And next week we're going to be at Lime Rock, Connecticut. Okay. Have you ever gone to that? I have not. No. Oh, you have to tell your husband. Okay. Take you to Lime Rock, Connecticut. All right, it's let me amazing. Drop that down. That's when they're having the big award, the big event, Lime Rock, Connecticut, next weekend, and they're honoring Paul Newman. Which is very nice, don't very you think? Very honorable man, yes. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Tell my audience, what have you been up to now that you've left the Real Housewives of New Jersey? Oh my God, so much. Of course, my foundation for children with cancer, Project Ladybug. Um, we're spreading our wings and moving into New York hospitals, LA hospital, Chicago, so it's really exploding. I'm producing an off-Broadway play called My Big Gay Italian Wedding. Which the I love <laughs> it! My Fabulous. <laughs> Say the name again. My Big Gay Italian Wedding. My Big Gay Italian Wedding. Yes, and it's just a heartfelt, heartwarming, hilarious production, and I'm so proud to be a part of it. And the girls are actually, um, my housewife girls are actually starring in for four days, September 1st through 4th, so that was been really fun watching them rehearse and get ready for it. Who's in the cast? Um, Caroline? My sister Caroline, Jacqueline, um, and their daughters, Lauren and Ashley. Um, so, and Teresa, of course, she's officiating oh, the Teresa. Ceremony. Do you know, everyone says to me, who's your favorite housewife? Mine is Teresa. Me too. <laughs> Who cares about that Danielle? And oh, I mean that yeah. sincerely. I, I, I think Teresa is that whole show. Teresa She's is, the whole show. She, I think she should have her own show. I keep on telling her that. Called Mother Teresa. Perfect. Hysterical. Right? <laughs> Mother Teresa. I love it. I love it. <laughs> Tell me a little bit more about this charity, though, your charity that you're working, and when the next event is going to be for it. Um, well, we run events all year long. Um, so we run little, you know, uh, you could always check on projectladybug.org, and you could check into what we're doing. But we have a beautiful jewelry line that just came out, and all the proceeds go to Ladybug by Euphoria New York. We just came out with a beautiful candle, candle line um, by Aglow. 
and um, you know we're, we're in stores all over the country and it's really exploding and you know we we help with the forgotten things for these kids and we just want their treatment to be a, a positive experience so they, their outcome is a positive one we're trying to change their mindset one more time the website projectladybugs.org to see you again let's Looking toast let's always. toast to the ferrari rally yes. right cheers, cheers. Oh, We are here at the Ferrari Rally in East Hampton, Long Island, at the Georgica Restaurant, and I am here with the Bastion. Thank you, love. Uh, so tell me uh, about this Ferrari Rally. This is pretty new to the Hamptons. It's pretty new to the Hamptons. I bought my first Ferrari a few years ago, started collecting, the collection grew, and I went to a few events, and I'm like, you know what? I love the Hamptons. I have a house out here, and I'm like, there's no, like, events out here in the Hamptons. So I told a few friends and last year with like 30 day notice we organized the event here at Georgica. My good friends uh, helped me out and the event blew up. So this year we had to have it again and as you see it's double the size as last year and it's a lot of fun. I'm not looking to do anything but meet friends, meet other Ferrari owners. It's free to everyone. It's a private invitation and as you can see 70 Ferrari showed up some uh, great cars all the way from the 1950s, 60s, 70s, all the way up to the new 2011 458, my favorite now. And uh, again, perfect weather, great people, can't complain. Loving it's it. fabulous, yeah. darling. It is fabulous. Tell my audience now, what do you hope to accomplish now with this rally today? I think just keep growing it. More cars, meeting more people, and having more fun. That's what I'm saying. Right now, we just want to have fun. So I think we accomplished what we wanted the first year. We did an even better job in the second year. Everyone's having a great time. Food, cocktails, the beautiful Hamptons crowd, beautiful Ferraris, and it's smooth. Ferraris as are gorgeous. Oh, Absolutely we, gorgeous. We got every year covered. You yeah. Know, we got some wonderful cars. Yeah. Now, Tell my audience, do you expect any big celebrities coming in the door We're today? Hoping that like Dwayne Wade will stop by and Jeff Gordon, and we got a couple of other good, you know, you know, knock on wood celebrities that are going to come on by. But I want to say until they show up. But we're getting a great response. We're getting some. You are having a well. Nora Lawler no, is yeah, a doing phenomenal publicist, and she's doing a great job Lucky today. To yes, yeah. she's doing a good job. She's so. really doing a great job. That's why I can't say who's coming until they come. She'll yeah, kill me. I know if I, she know. gets. I know. I know. I work with this kind of stuff all the time, so I know. Tell my audience if they want to find out more information about the Ferrari Rally and about mm -hmm. what you're doing, where should they go on the internet? Uh, we have on the internet FerrariHamptonsRally.com, very easy to find. Next year we're planning for July 11th uh, on Saturday. Originally it was supposed to be this July 10th, but Mother Nature was not in a good mood that weekend and rained us out. So this was actually the rain date on the 28th, so nothing stops us. If it rains, we just have it a few weeks later. Well, you had a beautiful day oh, today. It's complain. phenomenal. Gorgeous, gorgeous out. Not too hot, not gorgeous, too cool. Gorgeous. Just perfect. And riding through Sag Harbor, Southampton, through East Hampton. We had a police escort in East Hampton. I tell you, if every weekend I could have them block off 27 as you go through, life, I'd be in heaven. You look gorgeous, my love. We'll be back in a moment with more interviews coming up at the Ferrari Rally in East Thank Hampton, you. Long Island. Big champagne. Oh, oh, oh. I said cognac. Oh, oh, oh. I said cognac. Oh, 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 oh. I'm a ballet blonde, fallacy dressed to impress. One of a kind girl. This has been a Crybaby Productions, darlings.